<laughs> you have no brakes, and I slow down. You got two. Dude, is that your second fence, Dave? Dave always crashes into a fence. Dude, it's so destroyed. No airbags went off. You have no brakes. Oh my god. We need K rails here. We need K rails here. <laughs> You're good. You're good. Alright, so in a way it's all our fault what happened today, no. really. I did nothing. What are this? In a way, wouldn't you agree? What the f are you thinking? Sometimes I do things without thinking first. <laughs> so a couple things. Uh, yeah. Somebody needs to find a new van. Because this one's Everyone here has a challenge. We need a van today in this episode. We need a van. Grand Caravan GT, so we continue on the CGT. It has to be a GT. I would personally vote the design that was sent by one of you, the DD fam, of the Carrera Van GT in the Lark color down the side, and you did like a gray livery on it. I say we just buy a gray van next time, and then we can just put the pink on the bottom. But well, we need to find it today. That or black again. None of this white stuff. No, I don't no, want to look like a postal white white worker or something. This brings up a subject. We need block beaters. Talk about that. For a while now, we need oh, this cars. Up a subject. You need to learn how to drive. Hey, we just got, <laughs> many, Dave, we just got Dave a block beater. How many? Yeah, <laughs> this is your block beater, buddy. <laughs> how many fences is this guy gonna drive through? It's only two. Playback August. Oh, oh. Oh! So the whole idea of the block is to have cars to mess around with they don't care about. I love this van. Look at the back of it! Oh my you goodness. destroyed the back! <laughs> yeah, I'll get you a new one today. We'll find a new one today. It's no big deal. Oh, it's okay. not a problem. Daddy money bags. These vans have come down in value, so we'll get a new van. We need to look for crash supercars we can rebuild quickly, just for block beaters. I did a vote on Vero, and you guys voted on that. A lot of you guys want like an old 04 Dirty Gallardo. A 430, a 360, a manual advantage. We need to start searching for block beaters because all the nice cars are broken. Honestly, it's everyone's fault. It's, it's Mike's fault, Tim's fault, it's Damon's fault. What did I do? We need to find new cars, we need to get cars running in this episode, but we do need to find a van. So everyone right now, get your phones out and start searching for a Dodge Caravan that you can buy today. Because at DD, we make mistakes, but we fix them. Found one. For sale. For sale right now. <laughs> I'm we, putting this up for sale. Should we list this for sale? I'm, list, I'm listing it. How much? With the stickers and everything. We're 33, it's what we bought it for. At the peak of cars in COVID. So These we're are worth like what, half now? 15 grand? Not even. Oh, I think 15 grand for a nice one. You found one. 13495 black GT. That's not black, that's gray. Is it gray? gray. Where's like, oh, that's I mean, nice. nice. That with the Lark logo on the bottom would be dope. Can you call nice, PFS Steven? and see if they can Let's see if so, Yeah, I'll call PFS for some favors after you wrecked our van. Ah, I'm big on that one. <laughs> we okay. all wrecked the van. We How all did we all wreck we, it? Damon, you don't understand. Do you guys not agree fault. that this is all our fault? Today is your fault. <laughs> all of us. This is all of us. We're together on this. Okay, 599, where are we at? Oh, there she is. What is that? That is your uh, blinker fluid. So the bull work again. <laughs> blink, blink. Just ready to go. We gotta throw a wheel on this thing. Does it start? This one starts, doesn't it? This one starts. So we, we don't know if it moves. We haven't but. moved it. And we also haven't figured out what it's gonna be like with the new handbrake. Stay around because we're gonna get this done and we're gonna let Michael Essa, not Dave Coulter, drive this thing today. Can we hear the new power steering pump? Oh, weird. Oh, that's so cool. It's from the future. Dude, that's actually really cool. What is it about like weird noises that aren't supposed to be somewhere in a car that are like entertaining to all car enthusiasts? You have to turn on with a freaking switch in the dash. It's just like Dave's ex-wives. You gotta turn them on? He'll forget about how to turn it on. <laughs> it's the power steering button right next to the, hey, we used to win F1 back in like, what's that say, the 60s? They actually did win a race though. Kind of those signs. Oh, they can win races. They just can't win a championship. In the F430s, they used to put a plaque in that said F1 champions, and it showed the years that they had won. Yeah. They stopped putting those in the cars. <laughs> They're like, nah, it's been too long. It's been, it's been a hot minute. Don't advertise that. Everybody starts start messaging people about a van. We, we do need to buy a van today. Ooh, Ooh. camera guy's got a hookup. That one's good. Can you message these guys and try to hook up this van? Tell them we need to buy it today. Right now. Got you. Right? I don't want to be there for two and a half hours. I don't want a key fob warranty. I don't want a wheel I want, warranty. I want a key fob warranty. We'll take the key fob I want the through the through the fence warranty. Is there a fence warranty? 
<laughs> That's so goofy. Sounds like a McLaren. So that, that passion post for a Porsche race car or a Porsche street car? Race car. Oh, that's cool. It's basically yeah. a race car now. Germany yes. and Italy, we're gonna do that again. The first time since 1944. The ECUs from EAG, they are coded in a special way to make it work with manual transmission. The transmission control unit is still plugged in and it gets rewired. So this car already got rewired when they did the conversion, but now it doesn't have the correct tune in it for the EAG manual conversion kit. So we got somehow flash back to factory. We got a flash back okay. to factory and it wouldn't start because the factory tune wants to see the transmission control unit. When it was plugged in and it didn't see any of the other F1 stuff, it was tripping out. So now it's unplugged. I don't know if it's gonna work, like as far as drivability because- You're gonna try starting it yet? No, we can try to fire it up and see if it runs. Why, what's the worst that could happen? I mean, I, I don't know. Ejecto glove box. That's not mine. We got the new handbrake. Dude, it locked up pretty good when you did that. You yeah. weren't even barely moving. Yeah. <laughs> Just watch the van. I don't want it to get any more damage. Don't scratch the van. I have not driven this car once here at the block. When we came here, Damon went all Damon and destroyed it before I had a chance to drive it. So I literally haven't driven this car since December. Yeah, it's been a while. Oh, the beeping stops. Friday finally like five. Do like, well, you know what? Whatever, man. Just, just do what you're gonna do, man. <laughs> we're gonna do it anyways. And what's cool is this articulates a little bit. When you pull it, it actually moves. And that's by design. Yeah, it's got double pivot points, basically. So it's got two master cylinders kind of facing each other in there so we can run it with the ABS. So the ABS should still work. I don't know if it's working right now. It's not happy. But either way, when we do get all that dialed in. Dude, how cool is this, you guys? The Ferrari logo right here, right? With a handbrake. <laughs> That's pretty sick. Nice job. Bro. Oh, wow. <laughs> the echoes off of the K rails around oh, here is crazy. I still need to adjust the linkage. Nope. CSC system intervention. It said, not today. No. It is not happy. It's saying CST intervention. Oh, it just cuts the throttles 100%. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> That's so lame. <laughs> Dude, it's gonna be so good though when we get the ECUs to work right. All right, now. The e brake works. You <laughs> no throttle! You have no throttle! Don't look at Damon's face, it's like, what the hell is Mike doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah! yeah. <laughs> We're going? E brake? No, pal. It is not happy. At least we know it runs, so. And power steering works. Power steering works. E brake yeah, so works. Park this thing and get on my car. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> At 
this point, I am going to bring Art in from EAG to come and dial in the ECUs and then dial the adjustment because we're already like a month into this and the boys have lots of other projects to go. <laughs> We're gonna power! It said, nope, not so much. So. <laughs> we don't talk about that. We don't talk about that. So, put in the pile of broken cars, let's go on to the next broken car. Stick it over here. That was exciting and disappointing in the same breath. Quick interruption to thank our sponsor, and that's Vero. If you don't know by now, Vero is the ultimate social media app. No ads, no algorithm, high quality photos, the way it should be. On some social media platforms, if you follow somebody based on a certain algorithm and weird rules, you might not see their content. Vero, that doesn't happen. You actually see the content you signed up for, and that's why I love it so much. They've also really helped us do things like build out the block here at the DDHQ. Now, on that note, I need your help for something really specific right now. We wanna get some block beaters, cars for the block, we can beat on and not worry about. As you know right now, the Ferraris are being built up for it, but they're Ferraris and you know, we don't really wanna put them to a K rail. So I have three cars in mind right now. I'm gonna post on Vero. Go and like the post for the car you vote on. Three options of cars for the block, for the boys to come in and beat the absolute crap out of. On Vero right now, there's a link in the description. You can share what book you're reading, what song you're listening to, what movie you're into. There's so many layers to it. And it truly adds a level of connection to whoever you follow. You just don't get anywhere else. The other day I had a chat with the boys and girls of Vero, and they said, hey, we might add like a subscription service in the platform. If we did that, what benefits would you want to offer your audience? And I said, I don't know. I mean, depends what they want. So with that, comment below. If they offered a subscription service, what would you want from us? Exclusive content, live streams, discounts on merch. I want to hear all the ideas. Comment below. And again, thank you so much to Vero for sponsoring today's video. Go right now to Vero, create your free accounts, and vote on what car we should get for our first block beater here at the DDE HQ. Back to the vlog. So here's the thing, you guys. We've grown really quick. We have this big shop now. We have lots of new people. What we don't have is a system, and we're not that organized right now. So let's figure out what we have to do to get that car running. Get the car operational. Fly Art here tomorrow and have both these cars running. Yep. Have we found a minivan yet? Are you? Five bucks. Damn. Guy behind the camera, Nate, found a minivan. We have a price in Irvine. We're gonna go pick it up. Let's go. Who gets to drive the van? Because equally, right now, we're all in. Not a chance. Oh, the come brand on. Brand new van. I, I have never. It. Dave should drive it home. Not a chance. Not I've a never chance. broken a car before. All the Are you kidding me? What? You're civic. All I was hit. I was What did the insurance company say? The insurance company said that there was insufficient evidence on both sides. Meaning insurance companies are cheap and it's all a scam. No, it means that they're like, oh, you know, we can't prove no. you did it. Hey man, no face, no case. How's your wheels? The wheels are good? My wheels are fine. Before you, the accident, they're never curbed or anything? Before the accident, I got rammed into a curb. Okay, it's always somebody else's fault. You should get married. Now. <laughs> I already have a livery for it. You talk to PFS? Yeah, we gotta go there. Can we go right after with the van? Yes. Okay, we gotta go then. Yeah, we have to go right now. Master of negotiation here. We'll take a gold Lamborghini to try to buy a minivan for a super good deal. Cold start. Actual like two week cold start. It's unfortunate we all made a mistake today, together equally. Comment below if you agree. I need your support here, you guys. I need you on this one. Sorry, buddy. But, uh, lost. Mark, could you do 3,000 miles in that seat? If it was a fun drive, it'd be rough, though. Doing this wouldn't be too bad, but I know if we were doing 3,000 miles, I would have a backpack or you'd have snacks and you'd have waters or whatever, then it'd be a problem. But right now, just in here? No, you don't I could do. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm good. So we have a rally next month and transport fly car or homies. They're like, we need to know what two cars you're bringing. And for me, it comes down to either the 599, if we can get it done, or Squadra Corsa. Squadra Corsa is better on a rally because it is a car that's better at being nimble and has carbon brakes. When they get hot, you can really punch into it. Because driving on a rally is pretty intense. However, the 599 has a trunk for luggage space and bringing my fiance. And not that she packs a lot, but she packs more than I do because she's not disgusting. Yeah. They're with the same underwear every day. I mean, she does, we'll find out. Look at the shifter in here. That's a fun little thing. Dude, that is so sick. We are in the GR Yaris. Corolla. Huh? Corolla. Corolla. Yeah. It's a Corolla? Yeah, GR Corolla. GR Corolla? Yeah, because the oh, Yaris. So it's a Yaris. The Yaris is only sold uh, outside the States. I don't know what there is. <laughs> oh, look at Cool Man with the glasses on. Minivan shopping, baby! Yeah! Let's go! 
<laughs> Smoke him in the Corolla. <laughs> Dave will probably put it into a fence. Any fences? Any fences? <laughs> Oh, he cut me off! He cut me off, Dave! He's stuck in it! Dave, get him! Dave, get him, Dave! He cut me off! Oh. and help us with our cars, we wrecked them. Again? I'll pay for your flight, I'll get you a room, I'll buy you dinner. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Let me figure out my schedule though, because I got a couple things I gotta do, but yeah, I'll figure it out, I'll let you know. All right, thanks man, I appreciate it. You got it. That was easy. Yeah. Today we all equally crashed the minivan, so we're off to buy a new van right now. What are you driving? AMG? Supra. Oh, Supra. Oh, sick. Text me what you need us to get, and uh, we'll see you soon. This is the car dealership? Uh, but there it is, is that it? That's it, right there. Is it actually? Dude, that's it, right here. There it is! Career of me. Now, the photos are always amazing. I'm worried that it really won't be as beautiful. But we need it today. But I present to you what could be the next Career Van GT. It still has an antenna. Ours doesn't have that. Dude, it's like perfect compared to ours. Oh, look at the artist. Wow. How do you like the color? Do you like, like the color? Honestly, I don't like it. I like the black more. I like the gray. You know, it, it looks more blade. worn on the inside than ours. Yeah, it does. The seats look more worn. We swap the black wheels onto this. We just need to buy it, yeah. insure it. It's already insured. All right, it's even got plates on it. If we buy it, I have it all set up. So we go, we drop it off at PFS tonight. They'll have it done by tomorrow, all, all liveried up. They said 14.5 all taxes in, and we gotta get them down. Yeah. 100,000 miles. I think we're walking out of 10. 10? I, I'll, I'll give them 25 and we get out of here now. Channel 5 this year? Channel 5. <laughs> so we have a Dodge Caravan, but unfortunately today we all crashed it. Okay. We need a new one. Okay, there you go. So we need a good guy price. That one's all. What happened there, man? What's going on? Nothing you're killing me. You're killing me here. I'm stressed out. Can you start it and pull it out for us so we can look at it? That sounds good. Yeah. Start it up right away. These are like a dime a dozen on the market. There's like a million of these. Wow, that's what the back's supposed to look like. Piece in the back. I like the color, dude. I like the gray. Uh, so, Mark, we're missing this piece here. Yeah. Good news is we have one. But. And you thought it was 2017? It's a 2019, just yeah. 2019. Flex fuel. Yeah. You're missing the trim back here. Is this power? Yeah, it's power. Dude, it has all the panels in the roof. I know. It's actually grinding. Oh, right wow. Here. And yeah. sh it's shaving metal off of this when it opens yeah, and closes yeah. right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. So it should be sitting like this. Yeah. But it's sitting it. down. Oh, maybe these adjustments or something. Yeah. yeah. Fix the door, fix the yeah, trim. Or fix the door accidents. Pretty clearly here. How much 14.5 taxes in? 13.5. It's going to be a thousand bucks to fix all this stuff. I'm trying I like to negotiate bringing a gold Lamborghini. That always works out well. Like hey, let's do a deal on the van. It needs a bunch of work though. So, what can we do on the price? Let's be honest with the other. My I just. I'm losing yeah. money here. No, no. no. Oh, I'm, I'm losing, losing money. <laughs> let's do 12,000 taxes in. We're going to replace the door, replace the trim. 12,000 no. out the door. No. 12,000, and you leave here disappointed, no. and we leave here disappointed. I'm at 14, five year 20. <laughs> That's not a good deal. Yeah. So, let's talk numbers For though. 2019. I'll be honest with you, my friend. I put such a low price on my car. That's the highest this one on the market right now. There's ones that are it's 10 grand. Mind. It's 100,000 miles. Yeah, but it's 2019. Yeah, the year doesn't change the condition. Yeah, Ironically, actually, Mark. Yeah. There's a lot of dents in this thing. Let's get some paint with dent removal. <laughs> See all the dents? Yeah. <laughs> Buy a brand new car. <laughs> Brand, brand, brand new, they're like 20 grand. Oh, uh, is that right? I'm no, we paid, 30, we paid 30 for ours. <laughs> so what's the actual, like, what's the actual price for this bad boy? What are we doing here? We're doing 11.9 plus tax and license. 11.9 like... taxes in? No, I can't do that, I'm sorry. So do we want to spend a bit more and get a cleaner one or just fix this one up? I don't know. This thing is a good car wash and little... 
adjustment on the door, that's all it really needs. What else it needs? Well, it's well, not it, that if bad. it all needed that, you would have done it already and made more yeah, money. No, it's not that bad. I've had a hard time with this one. If it was like pretty clean, 14.5, yeah. but like look at the exhaust right now. $300,000, what is it, Lamborghini? Yeah, it's a Lamborghini, I got a bunch of them. You worry about $2,000, $1,000? Yeah, it doesn't change the value of this. The value of that doesn't change the value of that, bro. Let's chat business for a second. I got kids to feed and they eat caviar, man. I like this guy. What was your name? Peter. Peter. I'm Dave, by the way. How's it feel? Feels like a minivan. He won't budge on the price. He's a hell of a negotiator. He's like, you have a $300,000 car. I'm like, that car does not make this car worth more money. That's not how that works. Tell him 14, we'll take it right now. All right, Peter, let's negotiate. I have a new number in my head. Starts with a one. How about 13.9 when you get it done? 13.9 taxes in. I mean, you, you give me a quarter inch county address, you're better off, I'm better off. You, you just save yourself maybe two, three hundred bucks. Okay, this is business, man. It's We're just friends. Business. Have, you have yeah. a thing I want to buy. We're finding the price. It's not that personal here. No, of course not. Of course not. You give me a bet because I, I have to spend money on this. Mm -hmm. I want it to look nice for the viewers, man. You want man. car wash? I'll do car wash for you. Well, I need, to, I, need to, I need to fix the door. I need to paint the dent removal. I need to paint the dent removal. I am this. I need the trim piece. You got to give me something to look at one. Me. 14 grand. I tell you what. I tell you what I'll do for you. I split the difference just because of you. Such a good character. Yeah. And you're coming with that car. 14,250, you got it. 14,200. 250? 200. Come on, I gotta win. I gotta win, Peter. 14,225. 25. 225. 14,225. See, now you're filming. 14,225. Yeah! <laughs> We're buying the van, let's go! Peter was a hard negotiator, but I got him at the last minute there. I had to win. Would, would you get him? 14,225. Here we got 14,250. But he already gave you a deal, I think, didn't he? Yeah. <laughs> when did the TV go here? What goes in here? Oh, we are missing the panel. It's very DD, this man. The suspension is much better than ours, I'll tell you yeah. that much. Because it doesn't have NOS yet. I bet you made 20 grand off this van, Peter. Oh, yeah. Of I bet you did. Yeah. You hear him squealing the tires? Yeah. You don't give a f but he sold it. So, 35 years in the business, my business partner back here said you're a shrewd negotiator. I got you in the end, though, Peter. I had the final you say. Good. You got me good. I got you I good. He's a damn good negotiator. <laughs> and I'm a big sock here. I mean, what am I supposed to tell you? I'm surprised because normally my friend back here just throws money around. Yeah, like usually money doesn't matter to him. Yeah, not when it's not mine. Hey Peter, do you want to know why we're buying a van today? You had a crash or something? We all had a crash. What happened? Oh, oh my god. <laughs> That's what happened? Yeah. Why? Can't wait till you guys see the new livery we're gonna put on the next one. I'm pretty fired up. Are we dropping this off today to get the livery done? Yes. That's so gangster, dude. That's such That's a DDE awesome. move. Oh hell yeah. 14250. 14,225, we shook on it. 225. Okay. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm officially broke now, thanks to Peter. There it is, right there. $14,225. It's recorded. You are now a wealthy man. What's the first thing you're gonna do with your newfound wealth? Buy myself a Lamborghini. There you go. <laughs> Peter is DDE, the door's open, and he's driving. A Lamborghini? Oh my God. So I heard God. you, you told me you were gonna buy a Lamborghini. That is cheap. What that model are you buying with your money? Entire? Are you, are you opening the door? Please close it. No, no, it's good, it's good. It's air conditioning. Peter, air you with us now, buddy. I get pulled over by Peter, we'll, we'll pay for to get auto allies. I promise you, if you get pulled over, the cops are gonna know it's us and it'll be okay. No, just there we close go. it for like Oh, we got it, okay. Peter, I respect your wishes. I appreciate it. This that. time. It's all about safety for me. Oh, is it really? Okay, we're gonna play safe. game in a minute. Can you drive blind, Peter? Can you drive blind? I'm a, you guys, something happened. Any a minute now, Peter! <laughs> <laughs> I'm the guy you don't want behind yeah, you. Guys driving. like, yeah, that's we never right. knew his life was gonna what be do like I this. What do to my hair? You wanna take some more? Peter, I, I have any hair either. I the <laughs> the same guy, Peter. I've twice, man. <laughs> I've been there oh, married yeah. twice. You've been married twice. Me too. Dave's been through two divorces. Oh, my third marriage, bro. You know, was today boring until about an hour and a half ago. <laughs> you tried to pull a fast one out of the bank. You told me 250 to tell her. You remember that? I caught you. Well, you didn't get me a latte. <laughs> what is latte yeah, these days? Yeah, where's the latte? Yeah, I didn't get anything. They all got health food drinks. I was going to make $25 on you and you stopped it. You want to get dinner after this? You're not going to give me no dinner. No dinner. <laughs> well, you'll you, buy. You, you. <laughs> ah, there you go. What's the crazy? A story you have from selling cars. Give me this a one, this one. No, this is, this is it. This is it. This will How be is this the fucking, Oh no. 
all. You're not normal. What? Nothing about <laughs> you guys are normal. <laughs> Give me a break. <laughs> and like that, we now own two 2019 Dodge Caravan GTs. Hip work done. Peter, he's a good guy. I like Thank him. Thank you. Yeah, he put up a lot. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. This worked out the way it's supposed to work out. Thank you, my friend. Thank you very much. I Thank appreciate you. it. Absolutely. Thank you, brother. Thank you. You guys. If you guys want to buy a minivan, you know where to come. Yes. Come see Peter. Trust me with a minivan. Now we all equally crashed the last one. We're not gonna do that this time. In the brand new caravan. Dude, feeling good. Shifts great. Shifts awesome. Can't see the wipers don't work. These new wiper blades. Oh, the corner came up quick. Oh! <laughs> oh, you don't have anything to adjust it. I'm feeling right at home already. I'm missing our NOS button here, bro. Yeah. It's so weird. There's not the little rock form mount here in the middle, too. Right? We're missing out. We gotta get this thing uh, gucci up. Brakes work. We're here. Let's drop this thing off to Jason. Hey, free vans. Where's Jason? Hiding in his office. Why? Oh. Um, officially, he oh. said if those guys come, don't tell him I'm here. Okay. Don't tell him I'm here. Oh, barge in. Hey, hey. can we get done tonight? Yeah, can we get done tonight? No. You know, for two days. We need paintless stamp removal, a full polish, make it look Gucci. Hey, your hair slipped back again. Yeah. I buzz it off, and now it's back. Dude, your hair grows fast. Yeah. Must be nice, Jason. With Dave, right? Holy crap! He's so grown. <laughs> that was that was that was uh, Jason's stab at Dave. He's like, "Watch this! I can look like you." And then look at this! I can look like myself again. Sorry, Dave. It was a long two weeks. All right, you got the vehicle. We're heading back to the HQ. Hey, so how they come in? Were you in here? Yeah, I thought you were gonna put it through the uh, the door. <laughs> yeah, put it through the door. <laughs> put it through the gate. Brand, brand new. new. Yeah. yeah. Right? Like, what the Just per day one wolf per day one that's the limit per day dave yeah. that's pretty funny i do it did you get the parking job out here did you get oh this? it's sweet get right here? yeah you know he's just so yeah. what, what color is this one gray yeah this one's gray the first two were black this one's gray all right i'm gonna see the thing oh it's new brand, brand new, new to them. oh my new god. god yeah new to watch i thought i was getting a new car yeah. there's this there's a dance up there <laughs> that new no are we doing full? That was on there. Full check-in process on it tomorrow morning? You must have missed that. Tape up everything? Oh my goodness. That's, a, that's an impact right Don't worry about that. <laughs> uh, this is faded already, Damon. What? This is faded Wait. already? Hey, are you yeah. sure this you have isn't adhesive the one you guys crashed? Right you, you can fix this. You just get off The rubber gaskets get, 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 are starting to deteriorate. Hey, this top piece is starting to fade and corrode. This is missing a trim panel. Oh, you got the nice leather interior again? Okay. Does it have nitrous though? Not yet. It's going to get it. It's only Tuesday. Hey, you know the one thing I, I wonder why you guys haven't done for calling a Carrera Van GT? Why don't you get the CGT wooden shift knob to go on there? Oh, that'd be cool. Thank me to my guess. You're very lucky, by the way, to be taking this not a squadron traffic on the 405 now. Oh, yeah, totally. That's why I made Mark drive. Later, guys. We're back at the block. Oh, it's so sad. Oh, wow. Bro, I really, I really the van up, didn't I? We have all this done with the van. I kind of took it too far. Clearly, Dave ruined our other vehicle. My favorite vehicle on the channel, the CGT, other known as the Carrera Van GT. Clearly, you guys were huge fans of the van too. And someone, one of you DD fam, and I apologize, I don't have the letter still that went with this, but look at this beautiful render that they made of what the van could have looked like. Breaking my heart that Dave totaled the van because now it's never gonna get to look like this. Or is it? the brand new Carrera van on Daily Driven Exotics, you guys. Huge shout out to Peter. Peter! <laughs> Peter, you son of a And then of course, all the guys at Protective Film Solutions and a nose attack. This is the DD720 GTR super gloss pink. And on this background, it's got total Lark vibes. We got the Daily Driven Exotics windshield banner. We got the whole front splitter done. We had the whole car polished. Yep. We did a wheel swap from the black van. So we put the black wheels on. We got the Carrera Van GT 
logo on the side, just like the home he made in this render. This is render to reality, and we went a little further. Now, we are gonna lower it. We gotta get some more things. It's only been, this one video has been 24 hours. What a whirlwind. We decided to do the top deck lid of the wing, and we did the trim all the way around the back, and another DD fan, and Jason's gonna give me your name. I'll shout you out in another video. I actually got this plate for us. It says, not DDE, Carrera Van GT for the badging. We stripped all the other badges off, but I'm so stoked how this turned out. We couldn't have done this without Dave's salary, protective film solutions, and a nose attack. Cause this van did come out of Dave's salary. I'm so glad I crashed another van. This is way better. Stand back here and look how sick this turned out. Like from render to reality. We all crushed it. Thanks to everybody on the team for putting in the work. Him and the boys and everybody changed all the wheels, fixed a few things. What do you think, Vince? Dude, they greased up this engine bay. You see this pop? Oh, it's so bad. Dude. Look at it. Yeah. Hey, you need some anti-aging cream? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Serum on there? Yeah. This Dude, thing. It's the cleanest old engine you're ever going to see. Yeah, they, they snazzed it up. Miles they were, they saw these suckers walking in, they were like... <laughs> no, I got them down. I got them down. $25 in the end. Dude, Whoa. Peter hates us. <laughs> Hate slash loves us. All right, that's it for this video. You won't believe when we reveal the amazing upgrades that are coming to this because we're about to put in this van 